Hi everyone, it's Annabelle here. I just thought I'd take the opportunity to do a short back office tour so that once you have opened your doTERRA wholesale account, you're really confident with finding a way around at least to order, set up an LRP um, and do a little bit more than you know, just playing around. So I'm going to do some share, I'm going to share my screen with you um, so that I can... Um, just got to work out how to do that. Share screen. Okie doke. So what we're going to do is go to here. So what you have to do is you just go to mydoterra.com and then this virtual office page will come in. You put in your doTERRA ID number and the password that was set up when you opened your account. Both of those would have been emailed to you by doTERRA as soon as your account was opened. So hopefully you've held on to that message. Um, and so you just enter that details there. Click on submit. And this is what you'll see. It opens up into this MyDoTerra office. It'll have your name and number up the top. And there's you know, a number of different tabs. It automatically opens up into the shop tab. Um, and automatically um, opens up into here with this little toggle Australian products in the top right hand side um, and there is a toggle to choose to shop from US products so I'll explain that in a minute. So what I'm going to do in this video is I'm going to explain the shop page, I'm going to explain how to set up an LRP template um, and I'm going to show you quickly around the other tabs and I'll save anything more detailed for another video. If you've got any questions, just feel free to phone, text, email, or send me a Facebook message. So as I said, it opens up in the shop page. If you are just wanting to place an order, order one or two things, um, you can do that directly as what's called a one-time standard order. My recommendation is, however, that you set up an LRP, which is a loyalty re rewards program template. Um, which is a monthly ordering system where each month if you're spending a minimum of 50 points um, Then you'll be earning points that you can use toward product uh, so that you can you know really be saving a whole lot of money on product uh, You don't have to do that. However, so if you want to place a one-time order all you do is click on any of these pictures or the tabs along the top and You'll see here you can just search and browse the shop under single oils blends and then a couple of different ranges on Guard Eyes Blue, Household Essentials and Accessories. So, I mean, really, it's not that difficult. If you want to buy Arbor Vitae, you just click Add to Cart. And you'll see this pops up here, like one time, now placing a one time local order. So, and then if you want to go ahead with that, you can review the cart and proceed. Um, I'm going to cancel out of that because I um, don't need to do that. Um, so that should be fairly self-explanatory, everyone's used to online shopping now. Um, I'm just going to show you if you do want to shop in the US, um, the, the difference between that. So you've got the Australian products, if you just click on this button that says US products, um, you'll see down here on the main page that there are a couple of different categories that have opened up. So there's wellness, there's kits, there's sales tools, personal care. It's, uh, we've got a lot of the products here in the Australian warehouse, but there are a number of things, particularly in the supplement range, uh, that at this point you can only access through the US website. Now, postage is only $13.95 um, from the state, so it's very affordable. Um, they've made it fairly easy to access. And I mean, I actually usually put in a monthly US order and a monthly Australian order. But just to give you an idea, I'll click on the wellness section. This is where it takes you to all the different supplements. Um, the Lifelong Vitality Supplements actually is doTERRA's top selling product ahead of any of the oils, which is, I think, pretty interesting for an essential oil company because they put all their scientific research and attention to detail into coming up with, you know, a really balanced uh, multivitamin uh, energy supplements and um, omega-3 pack. But you can have an explore there. There's a whole range of Digest Zen products uh, and in there is great stuff for detoxing and gut health, Slim and Sassy with the metabolism support range. There's children's supplements, cellular health, like I've used um, the DDR Prime um, 
which is good for cellular health. It's mostly frankincense and I think turmeric, curcumin. Um, cellular energy, the my to, uh, to max, I use that too for, um, you know, mitochondrial support and energy. And there's a whole range of women's supplements. So you can have a browse through there. Um, let's just go back to see. Uh, the other thing that's different with the US store is there is the Healing Hands is doTERRA's um, charity arm. So you can actually make donations through here to that. Uh, you can also buy the rose oil um, hand lotion uh, and I think all the proceeds go towards the Healing Hands project for that. Uh, so anyway, you can have a play around there too. That's just to give you an idea of the two shops. Uh, I'm just going to explain to you uh, the Loyalty Rewards Program template and how to set one up. Uh, and in fact, what I'll do is I'll go in and set one up. So if you just go to this button that says Create a New LRP Template, um, before I do, I'm just going to switch back to Australian products. You can, as I said, do a US product one as well. Um, so Create New LRP Template. It says beginning your LRP is set to be shipped out of Australia. Um, I have got other information about what LRP is and the benefits of it, but the Loyalty Rewards Program, um, it's basically the frequent, frequent flyer program for doTERRA. It doesn't cost you anything extra to join. Um, the only, there are, there are no minimums um, in order to enter the program, but there are different benchmarks, I suppose, depending on what you're trying to earn. So if you're spending 50 points a month, you'll earn points towards uh, that you can spend on product. Um, 100 points or more and you can earn commission uh, on any um, referrals that you make to other people, 125 points per month and you can receive the product of the month which changes each month um, if your order is placed before the 15th of January, uh, 15th of the month. So normally what I would do is set it up around about somewhere between the 10th and the 15th just so that I've got time at the beginning of the month to think about what I need. Um, to switch out, um, you can change the orders each month. So um, I'm going to, for the sake of this template, set it up to the process on the 10th of the month. That, what that will mean is that if you don't go in and change your order um, for what you're wanting that month, uh, you'll get whatever's still sitting in your account from the previous month. So I've selected the 10th and I'm just going to add products to the cart. And now really you just go to shop. So say for example, um, we'll just go in here because these are some of the things that you might want to be buying on a regular basis. Like for example, the hair care. So say you might want to buy the shampoo and conditioner so you can add that to the cart. If you know what you want to order, I know, for example, I need balance. So you can go up into this little search, type in what you want, and that you can add that to the cart. Um, it'll come up and you just go add, add to cart. Um, you can say, I'm just going to show you a couple of other things. So we'll go to on guard because here's another good regular thing to need. For example, the cleaning concentrate, you can add that to the cart. And so you can see here, um, cart summary says I've got three items. I'm just going to review the cart. <coughs> oh. oh, I've got an error message. Let's go back. All right, so there we go. So this is what's in my cart. And it says here, you'll see, I've got selected the shampoo and conditioner, the balance essential and the cleaning concentrate. Um, you'll see here it comes to a total of 60.5 PV. That's the product value. Um, it's not exactly the same as the price, uh, but that's the points that you need to spend in order to, um, like I said before, to save, to accrue points and earn them back. Uh, so you can see this is over 50 points per month so that I'll be earning um, initially if I just signed up to the LRP 10% back on this. Uh, and that increases up to 30% over 12 months. Uh, you can see here it, you know, it comes to a total of $84. Um, and you'll see here a section that says use points. Now I've got points built up in my account from, um, you know, from my time with using the LRP. So I could decide that I wanted to pay for the shampoo and conditioner on points. So I would just go select one. 
Um, so if you're going to redeem the points, you've got to process the order on the spot. So you can say, for, for now, we'll say that's okay because I'm not going to proceed with this anyway. Um, and you'll see there it's a one time 35.5 points. It has brought my PV down to 34.5. So if I was wanting to earn points or earn commission, I'd need to be adding something else into the cart to keep that um, at the right point value. Um, but you can then go continue. Um, I'm not going to check that out. Um, and this is reminding us that an LRP less than 100 points uh, will lose your eligibility for bonuses and earning, you know, product of the months and things. So um, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to clear those changes. So I'm recording something, Charlie, out. Um, so you can also see here, so I've just cancelled out of that. But I'm just going to show you um, an existing LRP of mine. Uh, so I just clicked into this. I've got to change this for the month. Um, actually, I went in the other day and I've changed this, so I'm just going to adapt it. Um, but you'll see here, what I, what I do is give a little note in my um, notes file on my phone with things that I, either I'm wanting that's kind of on my wish list or things that are running out that I'm needing to replace. So um, that's what's in here. I make sure that I go in. Um, at the beginning of each month and update the LRP. So the things that are in here are the things that I'm actually wanting this month. And, and usually before I process it, I'll go in and I think, well, I probably don't want to spend that much this month, but I'll delete a few things out and make sure they stay on my wish list on my phones for next time. Um, but you can process, you can either wait for it to process automatically on the date that it's set to process, or you can just click ship now uh, and you can process it ahead of time. So click the changes. So that's pretty much um, all I need to show you around for the shop. Um, I'm just going to show you now the dashboard tab. This really gives you the insight into what's in your account in terms of points or income. Um, so that's what I'm going to show you. So you'll see here, yours might look slightly different. The, the back end office changed for me uh, when I reached premier rank um, and gave me a few other, a few extra little things. So yours will look slightly different to this. But you'll see here you've got loyalty rewards orders. And if you have been in the loyalty rewards program um, for longer than a month or so, it would say the points, how many you've earned here. So you can see I've got points in my account. And you'll see here that I'm earning 20%. So as I said before, it starts on 10%. Um, and so for the first four months, you're on 10%, then, no, sorry, first three months you're on 10%, then 15, then 20, 25, and then 30 over a period of a year. So that means if I spend 100 points, um, then I will earn back 20 points um, in my uh, LIP that I can then use to spend on product. So, uh, You'll see in this below where the points are, you've got where I can manage my LRP orders. So I've got my Australian and my US, and it tells you the order date in US calendar months. You can view past orders if you want to. Um, you can look at your volume here. So you'll see for the last three months, it shows November, December, January, each month that resets to zero. So you can see it's early in the month. I haven't placed my order and no one in my team has placed the order either, an order yet either. So you'll see here the PV, and this is just my personal volume, the amount that I have personally ordered that, that month. And the OV is the overall volume, which is uh, should usually be different. Um, and even if you're not actively building a team, you might find that I have placed people underneath you um, in the team structure so that your overall volume um, is... Um, is different. That's just the sum total of points of everyone that's <coughs> in the team below you has ordered that month. You can see here the earnings, it, um, it'll show you your AR balance. Um, sometimes there's money in there, sometimes it's not if I've used it to pay for product. Um, you can, if you are wanting, if you do build up and you have referred a few people, what you can do is before you process an LRP or an order, you can go to this live chat is online button. That means that there's somebody in live chat. 
uh, you can enter your details and you can ask them say, I'm just wondering if I've got any money in my account that I can apply to my order and then they can process that in part or full um, so that you're not then paying for orders. But you can only do that when they're actually online. Um, other things to just point out is here under qualifications, it will show you the rank for the month. Um, the moment, way back at the beginning at consultant, you can see, I might go back to November because that was my best month so far. Um, and you can see I reached premier rank. Um, I placed my 100 PV order. Um, the total overall volume was 6,114. Um, and this just shows you some of what's required for premier rank in terms of two links um, with executives in it. Um, but you'll see that change as the month, as throughout the month, particularly if you're wanting to build your account. Um, down the bottom, you can just sort of see different reports and who, who in your team has been enrolling people, new members, and whether they've got product of the month, you know, and LRPs set up. Um, so, they're the main things under those two tabs. I'll just quickly show you the team tab. Um, it's worth having a play around on here, whether you're interested in the business side of it or not. Um, the team tab shows you the structure. So I'm just gonna show you so you understand the way the structure works. Um, you can play around here with how many levels down you can go to. I'll just show you. So this is me here. Um, and then I've got the, the little um, diamonds, don't worry about, they're just people that have placed one-off orders but not opened an account. Um, but you can see here I've got sort of basically three legs coming down. Uh, oh. uh, and so, you know, these are, you know, I won't highlight over it all, but because um, you, can, you can see, you know, the names when it all pops up. But you can see the three different legs and the way people are placed underneath. Um, if you're interested in the business side of it or you just find you're naturally sharing, you know, your love of the oils with other people and, you know, say your mum or your sister or your best friend wants to sign up, just let me know when you do that so that I can help you work out how to best place them under your tree so that um, you benefit from that the most. Um, so team, yeah, that just gives you an idea of the structure. Um, you can have a play around in here. There's nothing you can or can't click in. Uh, business groups um, is if, you, if you're really wanting to sign, I haven't done that, signed up for extra emails and packages and things like that. Message centre is if you're sending people through, you know, if anyone sent you a message through the doTERRA website, but it's pretty rare. And then my website would be the other tab. So in having a wholesale account, you automatically have your own doTERRA website. So it'll come up here and say my site, um, your current business site address is, for me it's mydoterra.com slash what Annabelle cooks. Yours will be usually slash your name and then you can change it if you want to. Um, it just means that you can refer people to the website um, so that they can have a bit of a play around. You can add a photo, I've added a photo. You can add a, a bit of a blurb about you um, that will appear on the, your front page of that website. Um, and, um, you know, you can have them email you if they request more, uh, more information or to send the message through the message centre. So you can have, have a play around with that. The other just things, these little tabs along the top, your, your office settings, if you want to go change your password, you can, your personal information, you can, email and preferences, um, you can do that. Um, consultant services is probably most important for here in terms of registering a new consultant. So if you do uh, find that you're sharing it with someone and they want to open their own wholesale account, you just click on here to register a new consultant um, and you just go through follow the steps. So I'll just do this quickly for you. So you just change that, your products will be shipped to Australia. Assuming they are, you can get them, uh, people can sign up from around the world, so there are those options. Here you just want an on the ground order, local OTGs on the ground order. Click continue. Click up here to wholesale prices, that's the wholesale account member ship option, um, continue. And then you just enter, um, or they enter all their information. And then you'll proceed to the next step, which is selecting, you know, which um, 
either kit they want to buy or the $35 wholesale account membership fee and then pick and choose their oil. So that's all pretty simple. And that comes from, you know, clicking on here, register a new consultant. So hopefully that is helpful. Um, I might come back to um, stop the screen share. There we go. So if you've got any questions about your back office and how to, um, you know, how to work your way around it, any questions about what you're seeing in there, please let me know. Um, and only too happy to help. So I hope that's been helpful and have fun exploring your back office and um, ordering more beautiful oils. See you later. Bye.